Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, I'm going to be covering Ask Anything, which is an open source web application developed by OpenGV Lab Research Group at the University of Washington. Now, what this application is designed to do is that it facilitates communication and knowledge through a new way, which is by integrating video chat technology. Now, the team has been developing a smart and robust chatbot for understanding which has been able to enable users to have video conversations with the application. The chatbot will also be able to recognize objects as well as actions in the video, which we can see over here, and it will generate captions that is response to the user's questions. Now, this will make Ch Ask Anything an even more valuable tool, tool that can be used for different cases in the AI world. Now, before we actually get into the gist of the video where we look at some of the demos of what we can do with it as well as analysis of it i want you guys to go check out my channel guys if you guys haven't done so before please like this video as it, i would really really appreciate it if you can do so subscribe and turn on the notification bell for future updates and if you guys haven't seen any of my previous videos i highly recommend that you do so but with that thought let's get right into it so Ask Anything is actually a multifunctional video question answering tool that has been designed to enable users to engage in video conversations and receive information that answers their question. Now the application is basically combining several different technologies, including an action recognition and a video captioning tool. And it also incorporates ChatGPT in a way now, the action recognition technology basically en enables this application to accurately recognize different objects and actions in a video, which we can see in this demo right here. And what this basically, what the visual captioning technology does is that it generates a dense descriptive captions for these objects and actions, and it provides the user with the detailed information about what is happening in the video. Now, these captions can also generate in ranges of language styles to suit different user preferences, as well as ensuring that the users can receive answers that are tailored to their needs. Now, the application also features ChatGPT technology, which enables Ask Anything in to actually engage in conversations with users in natural and intuitive ways, which we can see over here. And ChatGPT is basically the type of machine learning model that can generate human-like text and it possibly does it the best right now. And this allows the application to user uh, respond to users in a way that can accurately respond to descriptive context as well as informative answers. One thing that I really wanted to highlight is the team has been innovating their application for a while and something that they've been focusing is on video language systems that is incorporated with large language models and this is something cool that we can see in the coming weeks as this could be very beneficial for a lot of use cases so this is something that is quite remarkable to see in this day and age there's actually three different updates that they had recently in which it basically adds video chat as well as different technologies that enhances the application. We see that there's one with Moss, which is another application that helps Ask Anything. Another technology that benefits Ask Anything is Stable LM, as well as Mini GPT-4, which is something that we covered in my previous video, uh, I believe a couple of days ago. And this is something that's cool to see how different groups, open source groups have been working together to create a powerful tool in video-based communication. Now, to give you a better description as to what these three applications do, as well as how it actually operates, let me just give you a breakdown as to what each does. Now, video chat is basically with Moss, which is a metric optimization for sentence, sentence simplifi simplification. And it's a feature that can be added to ask anything to enhance the application's video question answering capabilities. And you can basically like download this as an additional package to the overall application. You can also do that with Stable LM, which is another large language model tool that can generate accurate and inform information informatic text based off the given input. Now this context of Ask Anything, Stable LM, as well as the other tools that are used to generate descriptive captions can actually help in the better process of running the actual overall application. And this is the same thing with MiniGPT, which is another type of machine learning model that is specifically designed for natural language processing tasks. Now, if you combine all these applicants, applications sorry, and these tools, 
It basically enables Ask Anything to provide accurate and informative answers to user questions in video chat format. And this is something that we'll be checking out in the demo later on in the video. Now, in terms of installing it, you can easily do that by cloning it onto your desktop locally. And through that, you can download the required files. And once that is completed, you can install it using command prompt or any other Visual Studio Code code editor, which is something that I use. And once you're able to do that, you can easily install the different tools that are as well as the packages that enhances that overall application but in my case i'm just going to be running it through the actual web front which is much more easier and easy to run with my computer basically in this demo we can see that you can upload any sort of video that you want you basically click watch it and once it you click watch it the actual video is being queued and processed through its application and we can see that the state of the actual video right now is yoga now in terms of what you can do now is you can chat by clicking let's chat and you can actually start yeah the actually put an api key which i didn't do yet but basically what you can do now is that once you input your api key you can start chatting with it now i'm going to be doing that and i'll be right back with you unfortunately guys i won't be able to provide you the actual response that i was trying to get because I don't have enough on my API key, but something that you can, I basically ask is that what was she actually doing? And we can see that in this demo video that is actually providing you the actual answer of what she's actually doing. And we can see that the woman is on a roof and is doing yoga, which is what the actual application is answering. And it, another thing that the person asks is that, how do you know it's on a roof? It basically says that, I can tell it's on a roof because of the background in the video. The sky is visible and there's a green tree in the background. And another thing that he said is that what is she wearing? The woman is wearing a black shirt and a pant black shirt and pants and a black swimsuit, which is not I mean you can basically say it's kind of a swimsuit, but yeah. When was this video taken? The exact time of the video is unknown, but based off the clear sky <laughs> and the large green tree in the background, it is likely that the video was taken during the day, which is quite remarkable Remarkable to see such answers, guys. I highly recommend that you play around with it, maybe even install it locally on your desktop as you can get a lot of use cases of this. But basically, yeah, this is just like the overall video of what I was trying to get to show you guys. And overall with this application, as well as the technologies that is being produced by it is definitely going to be very beneficial and innovative for this basic AI world and I definitely will keep a tab on this and I'll definitely keep updating you guys with future updates now if you found this video helpful guys please subscribe like this video and comment anything that you want to see in the future I'll leave all the links down in the description below and if you haven't seen any of my previous videos guys I highly recommend that you do so I just want to say thank you guys so much for the all the support and backing that you guys have been doing over the recent weeks we've got to a point where we actually just reached almost close to 3k subscribers in basically only two weeks as i started this channel i started posting actively around two weeks ago and we've got to this level so far so it just means a lot to me guys so thank you so much for all the support i'm gonna keep on working towards providing you the best content thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time